Hi folks, welcome to Georgia Bigfoot in Georgia. I wasn't going to film at all. And none of this was going to end up what, what what caught my eye. And I'll explain this. This will be more of a explanation of what's going on here with the trees that's in Georgia and just explain like the difference of things that matter that are not a full structure and just point it out so you got this one this live tree it's a big one um, it's right there ah it goes all the way up there and then it's pinned right there so it's pinned and it's spring loaded into that tree so it's been brought down there's nothing that brought it down on the ground that could have brought this thing down and it's spring loaded if i release that it will pop straight back up and i'm not going to do that but it's spring loaded heavily onto that tree and you can see where it's moving and it's it's loaded up the vehicle ah uh, it's a pretty private road though um so and then here's the the glory of why this matters it's such a pretty tree in this whole area it's just unusual and, and, there's, and there's all the little tree sign all around. There's all these leans and, and just, just everything going on in here. And then this. This tree. There's no, there's no trees up there that this broke off of. Like, it just, it's crazy. It would be near impossible for this to snap off. And uh, I'm looking at this bark, and it does not appear to be the same bark as this. It's different. It's not the same thing. And then this one is completely in here, a whole, basically a whole thing shoved into here, and it's balanced off up there. So it managed to get in here, and then you got your few stick leans going in here, but, but that's, that's what I'm talking about. Um, there's just like, just about no way in odds to end up with that thing in the middle of this cluster of tree and this beautiful white log this this snapped off from somewhere and it's just there's nothing else like it it's just like brought here it's the only one it's like an albino log just shoved in here so What I'm thinking and then you got your your strange mounds with like a little nest here and some debris in that nest. And this is precariously put in there. So that there's just all kinds of stuff going on in here. But for me to point it all out, it's just all the evidence together. It's all the things together. All the the fresh trees down and the, the bent over.
and experience coming from this area. So it's not like this alone. There's things going on. There's weird occurrences, but I'm not going to go in that at the moment. It's maybe for the future. I'm going to more try gifting. I want a little nest here. You can hide down in here. You just lay here. And it's all surrounded. It's just completely surrounded. I don't know what made that divot. That's weird. That's really strange. That's really strange. That's just really weird. It's like something dug it out. And this is a really, really old cut. This is like a hundred years ago old cut. Beautiful tree, like a some sort of swamp log. This is beautiful. And if you hear bugs flying around, that's these little gnats. And even when it's uh, 63 degrees out, these little suckers are around. See how that is uh, right there and there. It's a combination of everything that this makes a little visiting area. I wouldn't call this where they're hanging out all the time, but there's enough going on here where I'm walking through a spider web. It wouldn't be right if it Oh, I got mosquitoes. Mosquitoes confirmed. Time to start moving. I don't get over the bites very well. Every time I get bit, it turns into a dang week-long experience, and then it goes into about a rash. It's going really well for me. I got one there. This thing, they don't go away. They don't go away when I get bit. It just doesn't go away. I'm getting sensitive. And the ones that get me in Ohio don't seem to pull that off. I don't know if all the people around in Georgia. These swamp mosquitoes, they just, they pack a whole lot more punch. So anyways, thanks for tuning in. This is This area is not without experience. Like, not without, it's not zero experience saying that this is uh, nothing so it's this is just a small little woods and a, like a a visiting place kind of like the underground railroad of sasquatch or dogman i'm not even sure at this point to which being is mostly in the area i'm not i'm not 100 percent on that so, I will be working that out. But it's, uh, and I don't film unless I have something to film. So I don't just throw out videos. Unless you guys want philosophy of all of this. And it could go, and look at this bend. This is a fresh bend. And that's a fresh tree break. Where I have no idea where that tree came from. Like right there. And this is right, this is pinned under it. I don't want to dare change that loop. But anyways, it seems to matter. There's a lot of them. And they're not everywhere. It's just in certain areas. So, all right, have a good day. Talk to you later. Thanks, bye.